So what are the main pieces of evidence people cite to claim the moon landings were faked? Uh, time to channel our conspiracy theorist side and, and shell out the case against the Apollo program. Hmm. So ladies and gentlemen, they lied to us. So, first off, a lot of hoax claims revolve around photographs and video footage from the Apollo missions, right? And one of the major arguments, which I find fascinating too, was the, the fact that the American flag appears to flap or ripple on the moon, right? Even though there's no atmosphere and thus having no wind on the moon. But if you look at that iconic image of the Apollo 11 astronaut saluting the flag, the flag cloth is wrinkled and it looks like it's waving potentially. But the hoax proponents say there must have been a breeze on the film set, right? Because on the real moon, the flag should just hang limp. You know, and, and really the next big one that they talk about is no stars in the sky, right? In any of the photos. Um, and, and all the photos are just that you see, the sky is just pitch black behind them. Right. And of course, the moon is very brightly lit <laughs> from the sun. But, um, you know, deniers argue that if they were really on the moon, which has no clouds and no light pollution, technically, per se, right? The sky should have been full of stars, you know, bright as day. You should be able to see them. And, you know, to them, missing stars are a smoking gun. You know, where, the, where the heck are they in the photos? Because um, it's one of those arguments that, that sound convincing. Uh, so the claim is that that shadows cast by uh, the astronauts and, and objects sometimes aren't parallel you know so anyway that's they, they look at that as being one of the things that say that it's been staged and they say the sun is uh, the only light source on the moon so all mm -hmm. shadows should be the same direction and anything in shadow should be basically black but uh, in some Apollo images, you can see details in the shadow areas or shadows of rocks in the lunar module uh, go at slightly a, a different angle from each other. And so they, people cry, oh, it's studio lighting, <laughs> you know. So then another claim is the, the lack of a blast crater. So the, so the idea is when the lunar module touched down, you know, if the, if the engines, the thrusters were firing it would have created you know some type you of a huge so. crater but photos of the foot pads show them on the surface with no obvious crater blast yeah. they just <laughs> are remarkably clean now, shouldn't they be covered in dust if it, if it all got kicked up from the landing 